Hey, Clementine. Settling in well enough? Yeah, thanks. Excellent. Want to help me prepare a little dinner? So how do you know Kenny? He and Sarita have been a huge help. Matthew and I barely knew what to do around here the first week. We're old friends. I met him after it happened. When he was with Lee? Yeah, he only told us a little. Connecting with people is so important. I don't know what I'd do without Matthew. I'm, I really think Matthew's Gosh, the guy that just died. Students. I can't imagine what it's like growing up in the middle of all this. Everyone underestimates me. I expect you to use that to your advantage. Sometimes. Smart girl. Hmm. Almost done. Would you do me the honor of tasting the first course, madam? What is this? Le Walter Surprise. An autumnal legume salad with a peach roux. Fancy sounding. It's peaches and beans. That's all we got. <laughs> Millions uh, of peaches. Striking resemblance. Anyway, I'll take it from here. Yep, the connection's been made. Soon they're gonna ask, like, if they... They're gonna ask if, um... If we came over the bridge or something, and then... Well, did you see Matthew? What happened to him? Blah, 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 blah. Pick up a CD. Cousin Jared's concert, October 13th, 1998. Um, I don't think I want. Oh, it Crazy. does have a CD player at the top, I think. Uh, hmm. I don't want to Nine make any noises. <laughs> I have a lighter still. I haven't seen one of these since. What's the song you're humming? Good King Wenceslas. It's my favorite Christmas song. What's it about? Well, it's about a king that brings food to a poor man. The king and his servant march all night through a cold winter storm to reach the man. The storm is very strong. After a long time, it gets so cold that the servant can't go on. But the king tells the servant to just step in his tracks. Mark my footsteps, scoot my page, tread thou in them boldly. Thou shalt find the winter's rage freeze thy blood less coldly. I don't get it. <laughs> it means that doing good things for people can be good for you too. But the servant wouldn't have been out there in the first place if the king hadn't made him. <laughs> good point. Clem, we could use some help. Here, Sarah, you take this and string them up over there. I want to continue looking, actually. You knew Kenny before. It must be incredible to see him again. When I met him, well, he's so different now. How did you meet? How'd you meet Kenny? I found him holed up in an old restaurant, if you can believe it. Hold up? You should have seen his beard then. Perfect. Now we just need the topper. We always had an angel on top of our tree. My family didn't celebrate Christmas. But I still love the decoration. So I think it's been about two years since Lee died. Not many trails. Go there. Is that a topper? <laughs> Let's what put a, a funny duck. Little guy. Mm. 
Mm, let's go upstairs. I think the stairs are behind the tree. It's crazy. Why would they follow us this far? We can't be sure. It's been a week, man. We gotta be out of the woods. We can't be sure. They might be tracking us. Tracking? Who do you think they are? Ninjas? <laughs> Clem, Luke said you saw some people in the valley. People? Way down there. How? I saw lights. Which way did they go? The Back bridge. Into the woods. No. Did they? We They're just lingering the around the bridge. We leave at dawn. But we're safe here for tonight, right? Clementine, you talked to that man Walter, right? What did he say? You didn't tell him anything about us, did you? He mentioned someone else. Someone else? Who? His friend. His name is Matthew. Look, I don't care what that man said. We're staying here tonight. Just talk to the rest of them. They trust you. See what you can find out. I'm gonna go find Luke. Honey, I, I don't feel so good. Beck, what's wrong? I just need something to drink. You I think the only people that I can right trust out of this group is Nick and Luke. Everybody else is being very vague and deceptive. Oh, I can choose? Let's put a star. That's nice, I guess. <laughs> Beautiful. Uh, I used to love this time of year. You know, now that your friends are here, this place is starting to feel like a real home. Awesome Matthew chandelier. And are amazing people. Honestly, it's dangerous to be this kind, but they can't help it. Wait until you meet Matthew. He's a real character. The first time he met me, he called me Rita. What does Matthew look like? Oh, he's a handsome man. A little shorter than Walter. He should be back soon. Clem, I wanted to ask you, does Kenny seem different to you? I didn't know him before, and, well, I'm curious. I haven't noticed. Oh, well, let me know if you do. Well, you three have been busy. Kenny, isn't it great? I got it, huh? I think I can manage, Ken. I said I got it. Hmm. You didn't seem at all different. But, I'll tell you but now that kind that's kind of weird. Fly. Why don't you go see if your friends are ready for dinner, Clementine? Everybody's being so weird. Stop being weird. I need to talk to this woman. Are you okay? Gonna be a jerk to me now? Just got a little dizzy. Guess not. I can't even take care of myself. How am I supposed to raise a child? I mean, how can anyone now? I think it's possible. How do you know? Stop being well, so snappy. I'm still here. I know it's gonna be hard. But at the same time, I already feel a little less lonely. Because I know that no matter what happens, I'll get to meet someone new. She's kicking. You want to listen? That food smells good, huh? Eh. It's okay. No thanks. That's okay. It's weird, right? She's gonna throw up. It's not his. Oh. Whose is it then? Alvin finds out he'll kill me. I don't know what to do. I can't believe I'm asking a little girl for advice. I... I wouldn't say anything. It's not your Here's place. Man. You alright, baby? I'm fine, you big dope. Just need to get some food in you. Thanks for staying with her, Clem. Well, everyone, dinner is served. Come on, let's eat. Dinner time. 
That was my knuckle cracking. <laughs> if you heard that. You okay, man? Yeah, I'm just. I wish I hadn't pulled that trigger. Shh. Just try you to killed her people. It. Right here, Clem. Uh oh. Awkward. Oh, who am I gonna choose? Who am I gonna choose? Who am I gonna choose? I gotta go with. Ah oh, man. Should I go eeny meeny? Uh. Let's go random. Oh, I don't know. All right. Random. Or should I flip a coin? <laughs> random. Uh, close my eyes and going back and forth. Oh, I landed on him. Luke, okay. I'm going with Luke. So what's the deal with your friend here? Yes, we were just talking about this, Kenny. What do you make of him, Clem? I trust him. With your life? Absolutely. Because so. I kind of forget what happened in season one. Walter was telling me his family died. That's horrible. A thing like that can hit a guy pretty hard. He lost his whole family? Wife and kid. He lost it a little after that. Whoops. Lost it half. Drinks. Oh. Well. Hey there. Hey. Hope you like the food. Oh, it's it's great. Thank you. Peaches and beans. Great for nutrition. Not too great on the way out, though, I tell you. <laughs> oh, Kenny. So it's Luke and Nick. Luke and Nick. You guys sure do look like a match. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? <laughs> I'm just saying you look like good friends, that's all. Is he drunk right so, now? What was your plan here? Hold out for the winner? Actually, we were thinking of moving on. Somewhere up north. You ever heard of a place called Wellington? Wellington? What the uh, hell is that? A place. I don't know much about it. I don't remember that. Maybe Krista like mentioned it. Up near Michigan. Michigan? You got a hearing problem, kid? Yeah, Michigan. Think about it. Fresh water, lots of land, and cold ass winter, so the walkers get slow. Sounds like bullshit. Listen, vanilla ice. I don't know what your deal is, but you're more than welcome to take off in the morning. Well, that'd be just fine by me. What's the deal with these guys, Clem? Hey, fuck you, buddy. It's fine, Nick. We're not staying. She's staying? What? Excuse me? You heard me. Please, don't fight. Gentlemen, please. There's no need for this. Now look, we've all had a long day. Please eat. Pass me that can, duck. <gasps> duck? Who's duck? Leave him alone, Luke. Hey, Clementine, would you uh, lend me a hand outside for a moment? This guy is so easygoing and happy. <laughs> Why? Happy people are suspicious. Uh, I'm sorry about that. Or maybe no, he does have his stuff feature. together. I, mean, I remember what it's like to be caught in the middle of two clicks. I suspect they'll find common ground soon enough. It may take a little time, but that's just how these things work. Everything will be fine. Listen, relationships are like any machine. You don't throw them out when they break down. You get your hands dirty and you grease the wheels. Everything will not be fine. Yeah, because really that group get along? killed one of yours. They say the world is over, but I'll tell you a secret. It's not. People are more political now than they ever were before. In the end, we can't change the world. All we can do is continue to learn from each other, to empathize and use our heads. 
All war is a symptom of man's failure as a thinking animal. Steinbeck. Have you read him? George Steinbeck, I've read him. Well, we have plenty of time to catch you up on your reading. My partner Matthew is amassing quite the literature collection. I think you'll like him. In any case, the point is, as long as we he have seemed nice enough office, before he died. We can always make the right choice, right? Right. What's the matter, Clementine? I need him There's to make the right choice me. when they find out. People are chasing you can us. Talk to me, Clem. There's almost nothing you could tell me that would surprise me. I can promise you that. I'm just worried about the people chasing us. You're safe now. Don't worry. Matthew will be back soon. And everything will be fine. Hey kids, what are you two talking about? Oh, politics. The hell? Well, being from Florida, I would imagine you know all about politics, Kenny. Man, I know one advantage of living in the apocalypse is not dealing with that shit no more. I was just gonna check the windows round back before this storm hits. Give us a hand? Sure. Bogey's trail, Dano's hell. Who that? Miss? Please, do you have any food? Are you okay? I saw the house and I have a family. We're starving. We live down there. Uh, uh, of course. Why don't you come in, Miss... Bonnie. Bonnie, we... Walt, I don't know. You're just gonna let her in like that? It's fine, Kenny. We don't know she this. She looks and seems then familiar we'll for some reason. to get to know her. Right, Clem? Walt. How much damage can this poor woman... Do? Check her for, Check her for weapons. <laughs> yeah. Thank you. Really, but that storm will be on us soon, and I gotta get back to my family. I'll bring something out to you, then. You don't have to do that. No, no, it's fine. What about your people? We've got plenty. You stay put. I'll be right back. Don't say we've got plenty. I have a little girl like you. Why does she look familiar? How old are you, sweetie? I'm 11. I would have thought older than that. <laughs> Usually these discussions are like a game of information, but some things you just much. don't just, mention it. It's not necessary to hide. To thank you. Just help someone else down the line. Thank you so much. I'll be going now. You stay safe. You too. Clem, go on inside and get to bed. Walt and I gotta talk for a second. So, it is Halloween at the time of this upload, Friday. Um, don't freak out. Is anybody dressing up as anything? Parties, whatnot? What are you guys doing? What are you Listen, up to? Okay, I gotta tell you something. That guy on the bridge was Walter's friend. Yep. It is actually my birthday, uh, Halloween. Kind of interesting. See, I knew something was off, so I asked Sarita about their friend. What are we gonna do? I don't know. I don't think Walter knows yet, so we have to keep this quiet. I mean, who knows what the hell he'd do if he found out. What if he finds out anyway? Well, then we're fucked. But, you know, we'll just... We'll just deal with it then. Now, do you, uh... You still have that knife? Because if it was Matthews and Walter sees it, he's gonna put two and two together. It's with the other weapons. Okay. Well, go get rid of it. Now I'll find Walter and run. That was a good fingers. knife. Oh, and uh, keep an eye out for Nick. I'm right here. What's up? Oh, uh, there's nothing, man. I just wanted to check and see if you're okay. We have to tell you something. Hey, if there's something going on, I want to know. No, just go back to bed, Nick. He, I, I think he does need to know. Or else he's gonna like flip out when he does find out. Jesus. Oh god. We need to control it now. Hey, hey, Nick, shut the fuck up. I can't, man. I can't. Do not fucking blow it. Blow it? It's over. I have to tell him, Luke. What? No, you gay. Hey, Nick, 
You cannot do that. Are you fucking nuts? I gotta. I can't live with that on me. Okay, I hear you, but f I mean, fuck, man. Do you know what he's gonna do? Either way is risky. Exactly. Jesus. I can't handle this. Look, Clem, just go do that thing, all right? Yeah. Oh. It's gone. Uh oh. <laughs> now the super nice guy is gonna like flip a switch and be the nastiest person ever. Walter? I always liked this knife. Gave it to Matthew when all this started. I know he's dead. Who did it? Was it that, that kid? What's his name? Uh, Nick? Heard him talking earlier, something about shooting a man. I could see it. His voice sounds familiar, too. I could see it on his face. Wasn't sure then. But now? It was us. It was our fault. Jesus. I, um... Uh, I don't feel good. Nick shot him. Is... Uh, is Nick a good man? Or is he just like everyone else? He is. He's a good guy, Walter. Oh, shit. I mean, crap. He was just going on alone. I told him something like this would happen, but he wouldn't listen. No, Matt always knew best. What's going on? You need to tell him. Tell him what? What happened on the bridge? Tell me what you did. Just tell me, son. Tell me what happened. From a distance, it looked like anyone. I, I, I thought I thought he was going to shoot my friends, and I I shot Matthew. But it, 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 it happened real fast. I didn't I didn't know if I hit him, but I did, and I didn't mean to. Do you know what you've done to me? Do you have any idea? I didn't mean to. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, Walter. Somebody just blow up the bridge. Damn it! Transformer must have gone. Oh, no more. Gotta check it. I could use a hand. I'll go with you. I'm going to. No, it's too dangerous. Rest of you, get this thing shut down. Does anyone know how to do this? Isn't there always like an okay. emergency shutdown thing? Nick, scan the trees with me. Or have I been watching too many movies? Burn the console. <laughs> <It's too dark. laughs> 
Uh, there you go. Or you need a key. Ah, that makes sense. Key. Poke. Twist. Push. I am so smart. SMRT. What? <laughs> Something ain't right. We don't have much ammunition. We gotta get back to the lodge. They're behind us! It's been a couple years at this point. You would think the density of walkers would have slimmed down by now. So just making noises wouldn't attract these people. Uh oh. Down. There we go, let's dial it in. What? That was totally ahead. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Run away! You have time to get the rifle. Not to kick. Yeah. Oh. Right. Done. I hope you pulled the knife out. No, you didn't. Oh. Choices. But AK forty seven. What the hell? Explosions. Uh oh. Howdy, folks. Hell no. Carver. Carver. It's nice to see you too. Oh, Dad! Sarah! Inside. <laughs> it's you. Keep moving. Why did she look for she was in the other game, right? The season one? Or maybe no. Was she in four hundred days, the DLC? I have to look that up as soon as I get a chance. But it's gonna be tough without getting into spoilers if I look her up. Maybe they'll explain it.
leave this fucking place, Bonnie? Power and everything. <laughs> a lot of windows, though. It's fucking huge. Bill's gonna hate it. Now the rest of them could be anywhere. Dun, dun, How the fuck are we gonna cover these guys and look for them too? Johnny, cover that window. Ah, uh, my nose is fuzzy. So he has to know safe. all along, right? I know you're out there. Melvin, if they Luke, and the girl. All know that simple. You want this over quick. You all play nice. She's the reason Tell that he's chasing after. He'll kill him. No, Melvin. We gotta go down there. I can't do that. Back the baby. You need a doctor. No. Where's Luke and Kenny? We have to help Carlos. Only way to help him is to do what the man says. What about Luke and Kenny? Look at those guns. If we start shooting, and people are gonna die on both sides. <laughs> Clint can sneak out. Find Luke. What the hell is she gonna do? And you heard him. Carver knows she's with us. Just stop! Don't hurt my dad, please! We're going down there. He'll kill you. Fuck you. Shoot him! Somebody just shoot him! Go get help. He'll kill him, Beck. He'll do it anyway. He's gonna kill him. Rebecca, we have to give up. Bill, stop! Ah. Ah. Oh. <laughs> you all right? You don't want to do this. Please, let these people go. Just shut up. Oh. Oh. Ah, his oh. fingers. Clem, can you reach my hands? Everything under control? I'll try. Break the fingers on my other hand to make it equal. Or that. Don't move. <laughs> I can't see him. Watch them. Whoa! Okay. No! Somebody do something! That's for our man! Now, I didn't want to do this! But you ain't leaving me much choice. So here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna march another one of your friends out here, and I'm gonna put a bullet in the back of their head. He sounds like, Don't um... Give up now! Your choice! John... Marston from Red Dead Redemption. If any of you guys played that, it's a really good game. Rockstar game. 
You remember George, Alvin? You see, I Chipmunks. I remember a guy that was your friend named George. I remember when you murdered him in cold blood. And why? Because you didn't like me? You could have lodged a complaint. You could have... Well, you could have been civil. Bill, no! We'll do whatever you want! <laughs> Let's do this! Oh. Of a shot, are they? <laughs> Where's Luke? Finally, cut and run, huh? Why am I not surprised? I warned you. I warned you not to follow him. Look where he's led you. But you're safe now. We're going home. As a family. <laughs> All right, round them up. We're heading back to camp. <laughs> they don't seem to care much about Luke's whereabouts too much unless they're gonna have people as human guards the entire way down Woo! okay this episode might have been long but um hope you did enjoy it. uh please leave a like comment subscribe and all of that let me know, I don't know if we saved Walt, how you're enjoying this series and don't watch this part if you don't want to be spoiled on the next few episodes. Let's remember, these are our brothers and sisters. Thank you so much. See you in the next one. They all role to play in this community. They strayed from the flock. Bye-bye. That don't mean they can't earn their way back into the fold. That don't mean we can't find it in our hearts to forgive them. Knowing full well, those who choose not to accept our love surely wish that they had. The storm is on the way. Oh, okay, so... 34.9 set with Luke. Haha. <laughs> Left to find Kenny. Uh, okay, so it's kind of... Polarized for these three questions over here. Uh, or am I there in the vast majority? Nah, crap. I don't know. <laughs>